In Delta County, veterans groups and community members held their Memorial Day ceremony. TV6 senior reporter Jerry Tudor shows us the 56th annual Avenue of Flags ceremony, and he shares what veterans hope the public will remember about this day. In Escanaba, the Delta County Veterans Council held its ceremony at the Gardens of Breast Cemetery this morning. Colors were presented by Scout Troops 410 and 411. Then the American flag was raised and lowered to half staff. The guest speaker was Stephen Kacharni, commander of the Delta County Veterans Council. He says it's very important to remember those who've died for our freedoms. This is a really the day that we need to take the time and realize that at one time or another, each one of these individuals signed the dotted line saying, I will give everything up to and including my life to defend the freedoms that we deserve and the freedoms that we enjoy. Kacharni says he hopes the younger people in attendance for today's ceremony will be reminded to take time to remember what sacrifices have been made. I want everybody to remember that those service members are out there still today guarding the freedoms that we so rightly deserve. And for all those that have been laid to rest, take a moment, not just today, but every day to remember everyone that has sacrificed the ultimate sacrifice. Kacharni also says the history of the holiday is important and his group plans to keep the ceremony going each year. In 1868, when the first observance happened, here we are 156 years later doing the exact same thing, remembering all those that have donned the uniform that have been laid to rest and thanking them and remembering them for their time and service to this great nation. Following Kacharni's remarks, there was a rifle salute led by the AMVETS Post 123 and the playing of taps. This is the 56th year Gardens of Rest has hosted the Memorial Day ceremony. Jerry Tudor, TV6 News, Escanaba.